first alert forecast. This is WPBF 25 News at 5. Weekdays at 5 o'clock, we bring you the latest discoveries and innovations to keep you and your family healthy. And when there is new information or something groundbreaking happening here in our community, we're going to bring it to you in our medical alert. You'll see it here every night after Dr. Oz on WPBF 25 News at 5. Earlier on Dr. Oz, you saw some nurses' secrets that can save your life. In tonight's medical alert, we show you how Palm Beach Gardens Fire Rescue Crews used an unusual treatment to save a woman who went into cardiac arrest. Eric Kellum will never forget what happened one early summer morning as he woke up for work. Rolled over, checked my watch, turned on the light, and and uh, and, and saw her. Uh, she was unconscious and not breathing. His wife's heart had stopped. Rescue crews arrived in under 10 minutes. Of course, I'm kind of freaking out at this point. Uh, you know, a little on edge, and and they just got down and kind of basically told me to get out of the way and let, me, let them do their job. It's what paramedics did in those critical first few minutes that likely saved Michelle Kellum's life. Squeeze this. They induced hypothermia, immediately packing her in cold packs and giving her cold saline injections. And you squeeze the bag of cooled saline into the body through an IV port, and in essence, that goes down to the core of the, the body and cools the entire body all the way down to the cellular level. Michael Lynette is an ER doctor at Palm Beach Gardens Medical Center. The goal of the of the uh, the goal of hypothermia is to lower the, a patient's temperature to between 32 and 34 degrees Celsius. Uh, we keep a patient uh, at this temperature for up to 24 hours, at which time we slowly uh, rewarm a patient back to their normal core temperature. The procedure helps prevent damage to the brain and other organs. Seeing Michelle makes doing my job worth doing. You know, just knowing that she can go home and hug her kids again. Today. Michelle is the picture of health. It's a miracle to be here today, and I'm so grateful to everyone who saved me. And get to spend time now with my husband and my kids, and I don't take it for granted anymore. They saved my wife's life, you know. Uh, we got two kids, we got a one year old and a four year old, and uh, we couldn't go through it without her. And before paramedics arrived, Eric performed CPR for several minutes, which doctors say was also critical in Michelle's recovery and survival. Doctors say they have treated many patients with this type of induced hypothermia, and Michelle has probably been one of their best outcomes. BG 